Kanye West's team claims more than a million dollars worth of clothes were stolen from a Los Angeles warehouse and now there's debate over whether he'll get them back. Yes, Chief of Staff, Milo Yiannopoulos, tells TMZ people in the rapper's camp noticed that a large amount of Yeezy Gap clothing disappeared from Yez warehouse a few days ago about 60,000 pieces at an estimated value is 1.2 million US dollars. Welcome to Star Updates, if you're new here, please like and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you never miss an update from your favorite celebrities. Yiannopoulos said the group didn't know where the clothes were going, but then he noticed a Kanye fan account advertising an event in Los Angeles on Friday where shoppers could buy a bunch Yeezy Gap clothes for $20 each. Law enforcement sources tell us they received a call about a suspected stolen property and dispatched officers and detectives to the location of the Yeezy sale. We're told the people responsible for this event told police they had receipts for the clothes, but police said they couldn't show all the clothes were supported by receipts. However, we learned that the police were unable to confiscate the goods due to content conflicts and because Yeet did not file a police report. Despite this, Milo insists that all the clothes were actually stolen claimed that Yez Group had no sales records and would never allow anyone to buy clothes in bulk. Looking ahead, Milo says that Yes Camp will do whatever it takes to get the clothes, including calling the police and now they've sent a cease and desist letter to the organizer of Friday's sale. In the documentary, Yes team accused them of falsifying records to make police believe they had received Yeezy products legally. Furthermore, Milo believes his team has identified one of the thieves and assures them that they will cooperate with the police to turn over any evidence.